The butterfly effect is a concept originating from chaos theory in mathematics and physics, which suggests that small causes can have large effects. The term was popularized by Edward Lorenz, an American meteorologist and mathematician, who in 1961 discovered that tiny changes in initial conditions could lead to vastly different outcomes. He illustrated this with the metaphor that the flap of a butterfly's wings in Brazil could set off a tornado in Texas, underscoring the sensitivity of systems to initial conditions. The butterfly effect is part of chaos theory, which studies how complex and unpredictable behaviors can arise from very simple deterministic rules. It emphasizes that in complex systems, such as weather patterns, ecosystems, or economies, minor changes in initial conditions can lead to significantly different outcomes. The butterfly effect can be explained mathematically through nonlinear dynamic equations. In a system described by such equations, small changes in input, initial conditions, do not produce proportional changes in output. Instead, they can lead to vastly different states, making long-term prediction very difficult. Small differences in the starting state of a system can lead to divergent outcomes. The system's behavior cannot be predicted by simply adding up the effects of its parts. 3. Feedback loops. Outputs of the system can feed back into it as inputs, further complicating prediction. Edward Lorenz's discovery arose from his work on weather prediction models. In 1961, he found that small rounding errors in initial weather conditions could lead to completely different weather forecasts. This is why long-term weather forecasting remains inherently uncertain. Even with modern technology and sophisticated models, predicting weather accurately more than a week in advance is highly challenging because of the sensitive dependence on initial conditions. The stock market is a complex system influenced by countless variables, including investor behavior, economic indicators, political events, and natural disasters. A seemingly minor event, such as a change in government policy or a statement by a key financial figure, can trigger significant market fluctuations. The 2008 financial crisis provides an example where the collapse of the housing bubble in the US, triggered by subprime mortgage defaults, led to a global economic downturn. Small initial misjudgments about the housing market's stability had massive, far-reaching economic consequences. Ecosystems are another domain where the butterfly effect is evident. For instance, the introduction or removal of a single species can have profound effects on the entire ecosystem. The introduction of the Nile perch into Lake Victoria is a classic example. This predatory fish, introduced in the 1950s, led to the extinction of hundreds of native fish species, disrupting the local ecosystem and economy. Social and political movements can also be influenced by the butterfly effect. A minor event, like a single protest or a social media post, can ignite widespread social change. The Arab Spring, which began in Tunisia in 2010, started with a single act of protest by a street vendor, Mohamed Bouazizi. His self-immolation in response to police corruption and ill-treatment triggered nationwide protests, which then spread across the Arab world, leading to significant political upheaval in multiple countries. Small technological advancements can lead to revolutionary changes. For instance, the invention of the internet was initially a modest academic project, but it has since transformed global communication, commerce, and society. The development of the World Wide Web by Tim Berners-Lee in 1989 was a small step in terms of technology but had a profound impact on how information is shared and accessed globally, changing economies, cultures, and personal lives. In conclusion, the butterfly effect highlights the interconnectedness and complexity of systems in our world. It underscores how small actions or changes can lead to significant and often unpredictable consequences. Understanding this concept is crucial for fields ranging from meteorology and finance to environmental science and social planning, where predicting and managing outcomes requires an appreciation of the intricate web of causes and effects.